Oh, what's going on, Air Hustlers, man? You tuning back in to another episode of Air Hustling for, for the podcast, man. It's your host, Don Draper, Fly Guy. You did. I'm having that shit on right now. Y'all can't even see that. I'm having that shit on. No cap. And I'm in this bitch with my co-host, man, Cleveland man. Junior, Some looking ups. ass nigga. Some ups. You look like Cleveland Junior. Some ups, nigga. Say having that boy. shit on with I'm some having ups. that shit on. Come on, no man. Cap. Ups and some Adidas pants, man. I'm having that shit on. For real, man. That man what's going saying, on, bitch? What that song was man, you just playing? No Put cap. them on it. Don't, don't ever say no co-host what's... shit ever again. Bro. I ain't no motherfucking co-host. I am the host. Fuck you talking about this is my show. Without me, this shit don't go. You understand me? But this nigga yeah. sound. Nigga that was they got them that blood diamonds. The boy heavy two four two four heavy. Got them featuring Lil Key and um Miley Meach. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that was an eight shit. Uh, that came out last year. I don't know when that shit came out. Mm, I mean, probably like right. yeah, I think like the end of the year type shit. But, uh, yeah, man, we back. Ill Hustle, what the hell going on, man? Ill Hustle 4 4, we in the building, man. We got a lot of good shit to talk about this, this episode. Yes, yeah, sir, you know man. We're going to be talking about the Grammys. Um, that boy Grammys. Jay. You know, speaking of Grammys, oh, I got Grammys. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you need, I got you. You need. We're going to talk about 21, <laughs> man, 12. And, and we're going to put y'all on a couple of new, uh, you know, a couple of our favorite new songs by some new rappers. And, you know what I'm saying? Some shit like that. So, what else? What else? We're going to talk about. Um, Jay Z and his influence on the game. Yeah. His whole is he the best rapper ever? Yeah. And just what 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 he does. If we were kind of everything outside of music, yeah, yeah. outside. I'd be the best music, rapper ever. But okay. um, I ain't even no big Jay Z fan. But you know, starting out, man. What so highlight the Grammys for us? I ain't really, I ain't, um, never, I never really ever seen a Grammy awards. Yeah, like, I never watched that shit. But I always talk, I always hear the highlights, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's I, what I was just about to say. The, the Grammy I remember the most, 3 Six Mafia, when they won, you know, first rap rappers to win a Grammy or rap group to win a Grammy type shit. What song it was? You know what's hard I hear for a pill. <laughs> talking about that boy. Skinny Mike. Hey, Skinny Mike. Yeah, man, shout out to Tell me this ain't my shit, Mike. Hey, Mike. Put yeah, your yeah. hands on these woods. <laughs> <laughs> Skinny I'm in charge, on, man. I'm in charge. Come on, man. That was it. Okay. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, man. So you know, I ain't really catch the Grammy like you just said. Like for the past couple of years, I ain't really paid attention since like I didn't. You know what I'm saying? The whole culture been been noticing big ass snubs. Niggas ain't really been fucking with it like yeah, that. But I mean, you always gonna big, catch man. the you always gonna catch the highlights on Twitter and yeah. shit. You feel me? Like that shit gonna happen. So I seen I that. Um, it has always been going on snubs. Oh yeah, that shit. People but, not being able to perform. But let me say this: snubs gonna happen regardless. Like exactly. you, well, you can't. No award show gonna get it all right. You feel yeah. me? But you can see the the shit that they got going on. You know what I'm saying? The strings that they pulling yeah. to make certain shit happen. You feel That's me? Why that, I, I fought with Drake. You know, for what he said, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let the people know y'all are what's really matter, not just yeah, what the people this think year. about yeah. Grammys. Awards not, not mattering all the time because, shit, a lot of times they don't matter. Like, you know. it's a lot of great players that are great. You know that what ain't saying? got they no championship. Ring, so got no MVPs. Just because you never win it all don't mean you wasn't great. It just, no, you didn't make you no know, impact. That's true. It just sometimes you don't make it, you know. But shit, or go the by. work, the work still don't go in unnoticed. Like say, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? It ain't, it ain't that 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 whole war show ain't structured for us. Yeah, you know what so, I'm saying? It so, ain't made for us. What so, was, what was your biggest takeaway from the Grammys? Man, my biggest takeaway was really like kind of what Drake said. But then also, you know what I'm saying? Like we was talking about, you still got even though it wasn't they songs, they was featured artists or just the young thug getting shit off of ad yeah, lib. You know what I'm saying? You kind of appreciate that also. You know what I'm saying? That that right. makes it big because we know how big Thug is in our culture, how big Future is in our culture, J-Rock, uh, J you know what I'm saying? All them folks, Ken, Ken, even though know, he been got Grammy. You know what yeah. I'm saying? And Cardi B, even though I personally don't feel like she was the best rap album, but she deserved it. You know what I'm saying? It's like, if it wasn't Nip, then okay. I'm cool with goddamn... Oh, so you agreeing with Nip had it as album? In that category, yeah. Oh, and them folk with the, who category. he was in the category with, yeah, category. for sure. Come on, but you man. know, 
It was, it was the best album of the year. Nah. Nip should have got a Grammy. But shout out to Cardi, you know she you know did what I'm saying. Yeah, she always. And also, her thing. also, my biggest takeaway was this: like, this, you know, shit. Future and Thug, they both won the Grammy, and they represent like a culture, like yeah. a certain part of the culture. It's just like For real. Cardi, she represent the same part of the and culture. And it's crazy because, so like, big. like I said, he went off ad libs, and Atlanta yeah. niggas yeah. always known for their ad libs. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like Atlanta and, niggas. And, and surrounding areas ad-libs. known for their ad libs like Those crazy, bro. Different anyway. Like he really take his time on the like. Yeah. He like he focus on that shit just as much as he do on the he verse. He don't sound like Waka Flocka in the studio doing ad libs. Waka 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 Waka. Anybody can do that type. Like, or or even goddamn the Migos just repeating what they just said in a different now, I tone. Ain't gonna, I ain't gonna cap though. Migos ad libs be hard. Yeah, like, with the beat, but it like. Like you said, Thug really like be he might explain what he just said in a bar yeah. in the ad lib real quick, like his shit extra hard. I mean, yeah, so thug, that shit was just a big deal. You know what I'm saying? And then the nigga who actually won the Grammy from the city too, uh, whose song it was, your boy Childish Gambino. You know what I'm saying? So it, it was it was some good shit from there, but but like I said on Twitter, man, we need that's some shit my boy. for the let's, streets, let's man. Get that I we need, fuck with Child to be no but We need some Grammys for the streets. As a person, man. they ain't my boy. Like, I ain't this. Nah, Child to be no ain't in my playlist. I don't even know what's going on. Yeah, mine. Yeah. It was, this is America. Oh, this, okay. is America. this is America. Yeah. And 21 was on that shit, too. Yeah, he 21 got a Grammy. Yeah, he should have he got something for that. That was. You know what I'm saying? That was a dope song, real deep, real deep. But, you know, next year, Grammys, hopefully. We need, uh, man. I fuck the Grammys, man. Let's put nah, together some title, man. I don't even want to see Y'all come together. Grammys. I want to just, I just want to see. see. Let's, let's put some shit up for I the streets, I just want to see more people, you know, get they, get they fair share. It's a lot of artists out here. I'm going to say fuck. And it. I, I mean, fuck the Grammys. Like, we fuck. still, we got the big two awards. Hip hop. We just got to. Nah, make, fuck them too. Nah, we just got to make our awards more. Not. We just got to make Touch more better. ground level. Like. Nah, it just got to get better. We got to make it bigger. Like. They yeah. gotta stop being scared to put on some other on other platforms. It shouldn't just be BET. It should be got down. Let us get the ABC slot. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, come you on, right. man. You right. There gotta be something better. We gotta. You know the folks own all them stations anyway, so they. Shit, Oprah. Oprah. Shit, get us on Oprah one for sure. On get us on Oprah one for network. Okay. Oprah, you, you know you got a couple billion. So, so, so speaking you of you and Jay Z can put something together. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, speaking of billionaires, man, that boy Jay. So we found he out. He got like 22 to 25 or some shit like that. 25, 22 Grammys or some shit. I didn't know he that. got them all aligned across the floor in his house. You know? Really? Yeah, that I shit. never heard that shit. What them 92 bricks at? Man, I don't. No. I don't want to talk about no 92 bricks. That shit don't make me mad. I'm looking for it. What is that? Man, so. So, speaking of billionaires and Jay-Z, man, so what's his influence on the game? So, we come to find out, you know what I'm saying, he he basically just sent lawyers to go help out 21. You know what I'm saying? And it looked like it helped because the boy got out within like a couple of days after we were reported that he sent the lawyers. I mean... You know what I'm saying? So, I'm sure, just speak I'm sure on Jay-Z, that. I'm sure Jay-Z lawyers are working. They moving like... He done beat plenty cases, fed him... NFL investigations. Oh, don't make me laugh. FBI investigation. We stood up to that. Facts only. Come on, man. You know, Jay. Know them lawyers doing something. Any man worth half a B. Yeah. Like, okay. If his lawyers ain't doing that, ain't making no moves, then who, who can? Okay. We gonna bring Johnny Cochran back? Hell no. You know what I'm saying? Provide that nigga, but, man. I mean, for Jay Z and his influence, we all know what he did for the rap game. You know, he came in, changed, changed it up, changed the flow. Yeah. He gave it some, you know what I'm saying? He gave it that dope boy talk. Then he said, hey, hold on, let me let me show y'all how to dress it up, how, how to go and get the money. Like, After you. Not just yeah. not just sign to a label and let them front you something. Let me show you how you go get it and then you flip it. And you know what I'm saying? You build your own shit. You know what I'm saying? Really That's what Jay brought grind. to the game. He, he brought that whole aspect. And also, it's just like what he does outside of rap, like. He really you know, played that big brother role, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that, not that, even you know big brother, just, that, just like, that OG big homie. status, like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Then my little niggas, if I look, if I say I rock with them, I rock with them. So I'm going to make him, I'm going to make moves for him, I'm going to make this happen. And right? not just, and not in it, but it's one but, thing. And he's so low key, so he never bragging about exactly. it. Exactly. Only way we find out is because the rappers he do it for let us know. <coughs> that's the only way. 
exactly, man. He never, he never put in a song. Yeah. He never tried to get rich off this. He never tried to get more attention off this. Yeah. He not clock chase. He exactly. just said, just doing what, what he I do. do is what I do. If you tell somebody, cool, but I don't really want you to. Like, yeah, like, I'm every, doing it because like, I genuinely you know care. I'm saying? Like, Wayne say shit. Jay probably wouldn't want, want y'all to know. But yeah. the man paid my whole taxes yeah. or whatever. And that Meek like, said he paid my lawyer fees. I, I was too broke to so, pay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Remember we talking about... Me, he got Maybacks, but he can't about, pay. Um, you know what I'm saying? We talking about Master P um, trying to... Whatever, big homie, whatever, Kodak. This, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, Jay don't look for shit, man. He giving See, these folks all type of looks, opening P, doors. Master like, he, he just probably... He doing whatever he got to do for these folks. It is more so... I feel like Kodak is more so still on the young nigga shit, not really trusting folks. He probably feeling like P got... Different intentions, but like we you know said, that's say. but but we seen he kind of did how that whole situation was. <coughs> I mean, but, you know, but Jay Z man, he he just mean a lot to the culture, man, because it's like who shows niggas the way if it ain't us? You feel me? Like him and, and Diddy, even though Diddy is a different type of influence, but it's just like who can show these niggas this shit really can happen? Like you really could be having this shit. Yeah, so like, I feel like what Jay did. When you look at T.I., when you look at Jeezy, when you look at rappers that from the street, Gucci man, that talk that brick talk and all this shit, the same shit that Jay was talking about once upon a time, shit. I feel like they all the niggas, they, Jay, all them niggas look to Jay like. Yeah, And what Jay doing, how Jay uh-huh. moving like. Damn, he switched up like that. Damn, Jay just made a hundred million. Yeah, like that, that. it pushed me to like, like, damn, you know I need mean, to like. And them the same niggas that normal everyday niggas look to, so exactly. like you can tell, like you know what I'm saying, he your favorite rapper, favorite rapper type okay. shit, like you know what I'm saying, outside like, the rap. Come on, man, the man he just he showed you how to go build an empire. Like I'm gonna take you through these steps, but you got to be willing to be yeah. great. You got to be willing to do this. You know what I'm saying? It's hard for a lot of people, but shit at the same time. His influence so big, like you don't know no other rapper that can go sit down with these certain certain billionaires that he, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like certain people that he's sitting down with, you'll never, never see a nigga see like yeah. regular rappers. And then, you know what I'm and then he's not switching up. He's sitting down with you folks, but still holding it down for exactly. us. Exactly. That's what's important. Turn down the Super Bowl, even though even though I wouldn't have turned down the Super Trying Bowl. Trying to convince niggas to be like, you know what I'm saying, just you know. He, he really for but the culture. He really for the what, culture. What man. I really fuck with about Jay now that he got the whole, the whole sports agency thing too. So it's so he taking it to the sports. He's showing he's showing the niggas the athlete like look, bro, you can get this type of money. You sign with this Rock Nation, whatever. Who, who, you know what I'm saying? He had Zion Williamson game. They made in college. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He he know what's going on. Shit, let me show little bro how to, he can be. Bigger than LeBron, he can take yeah. it further than you know what I'm saying. And it don't even seem like he be trying to like, like you said, get nothing from nobody. Trying to charge no fee, you know what I'm saying? This is game that's yeah. worth million yeah. dollar game for real, like yeah. for free. That's just like the whole twenty one seven shit. Like he ain't say nothing. He just sent the lawyers. Yeah. They did what they yeah, did. Lawyers. And you know shit, like you said, he was out within a couple of weeks and with shit, not even a whole week. Twenty one seven finally days. coming home. You know, felt real no, good so, seeing him so, come so, home, like. Hey, I man. know my boy probably was in ice like he didn't got me fucked up. That man. boy said he was twenty. That shit y'all. probably worse than got down the Cab County, Rice Street, all along put together. That shit was crazy, bro. Right. That nigga, man. So how do you feel about the whole twenty one savage coming home situation? Man, I feel like you know what I'm saying. Like if you listen to his interview on Good Morning America, you know what I'm saying. He said even himself he wasn't tripping because he know every time, like what what his whole team like. Everybody, you know what I'm saying, all them East Side PD niggas, you know, all them niggas saying they don't plan for this shit. They like this ain't no surprise that this could happen. Yeah. Now how it happened, that's some different shit. You see what I'm saying? They plotted on my boy, but so this you actually feel like happening. He was, he was a target. Oh yeah, my boy even said he was a target. He said I mean, of course he could feel like he was a target. That's true, but that's true. But how they said I mean, we talked about this last episode, how Ice was already on scene. Like, nigga, that ain't you get them folks to the station, then you call who you supposed to call. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, oh, you're supposed to pick oh, him exactly, up from the exactly. Them niggas was on the scene, so they was waiting on his ass. They was they, they probably sent back. Why exactly. They, they, they seen the other lights. investigation. Them they folks had going on, and then they, they, they oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, you want a part of that? 
No, oh yeah, he got warrants. We gonna go and snatch him. Come up. up. And, and then call. go ahead. Hey, yeah, we got that nigga Home. 21 over here for you. Kill him goddamn seven <laughs> birds and one stone. No cap. But like. you know, when they say he got arrested, they say he was speeding off, uh, driving recklessly. Shit, and then he had, the, he had a pistol on him. But, but my boy Ben saying, you're not going to catch me without right. the wham bam. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, ben like, I'm not going nowhere without the wham bam. Nigga, you're not going to catch me slipping. You know what I'm saying? Real PDE, slaughter gang shit. <laughs> but oh, it's, it's just crazy, bro. Like, okay, like, you pulling him over. You say he recklessly driving. Why the fuck are you locking nigga up for reckless driving? Shit, they just did the same thing to uh, your boy, Baby. They had a boy slant. Nah, but for rec- they said bro was reckless driving. But hold on, said, hold on. Then, let's let's bring you back to twenty one first. We're gonna get into the baby shit a little separately because that was different. I can't I, cap. I can't cap. How so twenty one said when you know driving reckless, get caught with a pistol, whatever. Okay, that's you supposed to lock him up, take him to the station. How the hell I just pulled straight up on my boy like that? Like, come like on, man. So he told me they got him. They're like, we got sad. We got not sad. Even, not like, even this situation. Shit. The whole situation with when he got out, it's, some, it's a lady or a club promoter say he ran off of $17,000 like three years ago. But they been pressed short. They been did a police report, but now they want to. You know what I'm saying? Move forward with it. Three years out. Because they know he because in the Because they, yeah, they heard about the whole ISIS situation. So now, I feel like, to me, that shit lame as hell. Uh, like, yeah. You gonna you wait three what? years? You could have been when you got your pay because he been getting been some money. Going up. Like, he, he ain't doing shit but going up. You know what I'm saying? You could have been when they had to sue him, whatever you had to do before exactly. the ISIS shit even came up, before you even heard about it. Exactly. That shit there, my boy, lame as hell. Yeah. I can't rock with that. That shit whack. Like, but... You know, niggas, niggas is praying for the best of twenty one. I yeah, think he got that shit gonna animal, be straight. Animal but I hope, fake, I hope man. they don't deport him. You know, even though he's they, still facing deportation and yeah. shit. They, they said, they said that boy came in at twelve. That nigga said he came in at seven. Man, they've been trying to cap to us. So yeah. Like you said, you can't believe everything you say. Reports can't. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? He gonna try to make it look at the best on his side too, but. Can't believe on shit. Them folks gonna spend exactly. it however they want, man. But, but you know, y'all niggas need fast calls in Atlanta, but y'all gotta watch where y'all man. at. Cause bro, these the niggas, I feel this. like every nigga in, the, in these foreign cars with them tinted windows, I don't give a fuck who you, you is. They, they don't even know who you is. Exactly. They, they, they gonna pull that motherfucker over. And, uh, and Georgia they be State having Patrol, that limo tint. Georgia State Patrol gonna pull that motherfucker over. They not playing. Yeah, they they just gave to the boy baby. Yeah. They got baby locked up. Boy, but now, like see, I say, I say the difference was because it was it was it was a clip of baby speeding off. So they say what? baby sitting him on the high I speed didn't see chase. No clip for that. Yeah, the see, only clip I seen with him on the ground. Was nah, rough, see, you know it's another saying? video. Like I seen the video, like somebody recording baby speeding, like just speeding in they bit. They say twelve get behind the baby. Got down, he keep it going. And when twelve I, get behind me, I'ma yeah. smash. Shit, then, nigga. I got down when it's I was working at the Boys and Girl Club. It's this dude named Larry that be in the bluff. He yeah. might, he might come out there sometimes shoot hoops. And Larry like, oh yeah, oh yeah, but oh yeah, but I see the boy twenty one seven, but he smashed not on twelve. I'm talking, he hitting that ball, he hitting it. Like you know, so I'm like, okay, yeah, twenty one. So he said he might ask me. I mean, baby smashing. doing that. He said he see baby sh- like just yeah. you know just flying down the street right there coming around Lee Street on the West End. I'm like, so you know, well, he probably, that's probably true. Nigga probably was speeding. Twelve probably got. Well, see, him. I ain't see that clip. That's what I was saying. I ain't yeah, see that. I mean, I but see see speeding clip. I don't think they would just pull him over for no reason. It had to be like some speeding or a reckless. I ain't gonna say we don't put like. Okay, so let's speak on that. Or like, even even they, even tent like you know that's that's the law. Like your tent too dark, they can pull you over. So they're like. They be having reasons to pull you over. They find you. the smaller reason, yeah, it but they be make a it bullshit to get, reason. Yeah. yeah, like you can't get them for no reason to pull you, you over. Like, that makes no. That's true. though. When you riding in a paper when tent, you know what it is. Yeah. Tent, you speed. Yeah, you got them. You, you, you go over yeah. the lane. You in the city, like you said, Ryan. Any new car, any foreign, you look right, like right. us, man. They not. They not. They gonna find any, like you said, any small they reason. Gonna, they gonna ride behind you until you exactly until you do something, dude. You might almost run the red light and hit the brake hard. They gonna. Hey, get your bitch up. ass over to the right place. <laughs> they gonna wait for that. Well, bro, they on the lane shit right now in Atlanta, like. Yeah, yeah. But 
Maybe ain't the only one they they arrested right now. Shit, Ooh. you know. Uh, well, NBA young boy got young locked boy. up. But that, like you said, that's a whole different situation in this I don't know too, bro. They, they said, saying they said he they had said, he had a whole beat up a goddamn. Yeah, because <laughs> the man the man walked in while they were fucking or something. <laughs> beat up. So he told he told it whole shit. Hey, he said, that nigga walk. crazy as hell, bro. First of all, I'm trying to see what whole crazy. fucking NBA young boy I heard. They had a picture of Shawty. I'm saying she looked retarded in hell with her shit. Why them though? But the man got herpes. <laughs> yeah, everybody know that. Look that shit don't matter. That nigga herpes, got money. Herpes don't leave right. though. That, that shit don't matter to them. That nigga got money. So what he paying for them? He paying for them? Nah, but you know they got medication and shit to come and suppress it and not give it to somebody else. No, like if you take the medication, it's a, you can suppress it and not basically, you know what I'm saying? It won't. You can't pass it along. Basically. But I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, how we know her, he been taking his shit though? That nigga do like an irresponsible ass thirteen year old, no cap. No, I'm saying, <laughs> like, like he ain't taking that shit every day. These, these folks out here risking it all the fuck with him. And you know he ain't fucking with no condom. That's a man, BR nigga I, for you. I know he probably no, fucking cow. some nothing else. Hey, man. That's a BR nigga for I you. I don't know. It be, but it be the bad bitches that be going for shit like that, too. The man. money, though. The money and the money yeah. and the fame that come along with it, bro. I would do anything, have, bro. I would rather have 10 bands. And a, hundred, and a million followers than, than and good help. What she the hell? The, she want the 10 bands and the, 10 bands and a million followers and have herpes. <laughs> Tell me the damn. That what's going on? Who that is not like crazy? That? Uh, well, he didn't get like he turned himself in because of go trouble, but oh, he yeah, just got back yeah. home, school. He just bought a big ass. Yeah, yeah, his ass be going in and out too. But the boy Bloody J just officially came home. You know what I'm saying? He damn, was but like when he home like a yeah, couple he, months ago. Yeah, but halfway house type shit. Oh, okay, okay, you okay. So he's home, home, home now. Okay, okay. I see he dropped the tape. Yeah, you know. Y'all go check Bloody J, man. I used to want to be a blood because of Bloody J. Really? Man. Yeah. That's crazy. You know, cat. Nah. I got blood in my eyes. Bloody J got a unique I got goddamn I got blood in my eyes. Style. No cap. That shit be Ain't crazy. Ain't going in. Yeah, he do. But I don't know, I don't know if Bloody J going to survive in the time time. nowadays because it's just something. Like a different his way. Real, and yeah, his way, his time about over with. I don't know, though. I mean, folks going to always fuck with him. Don't get me wrong. Like, especially... Some Atlanta folks, but far as catching mainstream, yeah, I don't think he's, I don't think he gonna pop mainstream. Nah, probably it not. Just, probably just be one of the OG just, Atlanta rappers. Just, like you know, when you get locked up and you don't, you get a certain age and you get a you got a certain style, and this shit you, just changed. That nigga was locked way, up for a minute. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Had he, been, he had that way with that rich game, been that the whole game way shit, dropped too though. You know so that's, but part. that's when he got locked right yeah. up, like. Yeah. Yeah. After that six tape. months into that shit, after his feature, exactly. Yeah, yeah. See if he would ever got locked up, Bloody. he'd probably he'd be out of here. He'd be on some whole other shit. But you know, got them. Who else got locked up? Um, fuck it, motherfucker. Was that Nah? Luchi ain't just get locked up. Nah. Um, fuck, I can't even remember. No, I think that might. That's about it. Well, Quant, I mean, Quant Cash got out. That's the only person. That's a minute ago. Okay. Yeah, so them about the only people APD yeah. been fucking with. You know what I'm saying? Not just APD, just, we just talk about it. Celebrities and shit. Niggas come to Atlanta. I don't know why niggas come to Atlanta. Think it's sweet. Like, they think it's sweet. They, they think, they think it's so 12. Sweet. Like, we be trying to tell niggas, like, 12 don't be playing here. Yeah, they be on the bullshit. No we problem. don't even want to fuck around with these folks. And y'all want to yeah, come nah. here and fuck around with these folks? Come on, Everything man. They on whatever, baby. They like to see out of town niggas here. What? Who? Oh, we got us one. Hell yeah. yeah. That's, how they, that's exactly what. Yeah, yeah, they we got that one. But I really believe them folks be in the station. Like, okay. You know what I'm saying? These folks come like Super Bowl. Okay, yeah, we go. Yeah, these folks come. They go ahead and get their quota, right? Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Have some big cases. Exactly. Get some wins. Right. Like, they be on that shit, That's just like, that's like the government just offer you, boy, Rollo, five years. Yeah. That boy say, they say he smile, laugh, say, I'll be home this year. No cap. Hello? Hey, man, free but that shit, boy when, they start, up, when they start giving you, when they start offering you some shit, then you know you, you, you kind of good. Like, yeah, like, you know yeah, they trying like, to pressure you into taking yeah, spots. They probably ain't got everything they, they probably, need on you. They can't, they can't, you know they can't, they can't, they can't, they they want you to go on and yeah. take that deal. Yeah, that but case then, cool, cool. See, still that chance, like, he might turn the deal down, go to court, and lose. Yeah. It just all depends on what they build up. It don't sound like they case is. 100 all the way. Exactly. You know That's why saying? they want him to go on cop and take that go. five. But they already know if he take a five, he ain't going to do nothing but, like, three years. No he already count. been in about eight yeah. to ten months, and then they give you two for one. So, you know, he going yeah. to max out about... 2021 type shit. Yeah, so he, he yeah, bro, you right though. So, so they, yeah. so they like, Boy, shit, bro, go, go to take, just take the five, man. Hey, 
Just take it. They daring him. Please take the other day. All them folk fucking with that boy. Exactly, but shit, I ain't gonna say he gonna be out this year, but top soon. I, I feel like top of 2020, you know, we'll Rollo, be... You think Rollo Wayne still right? going to be the same? Yeah, yeah, he'll, he'll come back harder. I feel Rollo, like he a hard body that he like. I feel like Jay Rollo, he just got his own lane, and what he talking about, it's just like, it made everybody tune in, like... Yeah, and what he actually doing. Exactly. Like, nigga really is, he bought a whole apartment complex, Little Pakistan, rent free, really furnishing no motherfuckers. Really like. bucked on 12, let yeah. folk know everything that going on. Op shit, pop shit, 12 cannot stop shit. Literally they, said they, hold, they pausing it, but they, they can't stop it. They pausing it, but they ain't stopping it. I mean, <laughs> pausing that motherfucker. Hey, a, little, a little long pause, but they can't that stop whole, shit. Since, since Rollo been did. locked up, like, that whole that whole side, just, you can just tell, like. Oh, yeah, you dropped that little Pakistan. Like, it's a little, you know what I'm saying? We're going to speak on it, but you know. Yeah, down, like, yeah, yeah, you can tell like, it's a difference. Like, yeah, it's a damn show so different, maybe, especially West Coast. You know, Baby always on the road. Yeah, it ain't so the same. Just, it ain't turned up like no more. Yeah. Man, you know, niggas okay. over there having some little, little pressure and shit with other folks. And they yeah, don't, they ain't gonna get into all that. You know, they ain't gonna get into all that. It's a lot of bullshit man. going on okay. in little Pakistan. Man, you know. That's your but, side of town, ain't it? So who else? Uh, Yeah, I'm from the West End. Oh, okay. are you? White Street, Niggaville. Yeah, yeah, oh, sir. Yeah, that's sir. what y'all call it? Yeah, Niggaville. Yeah, that's worse than that. Who called it the Niggaville? Go ahead, man. Oh, you being the dead end? Go ahead on, man. The worst thing. Chap going crazy right there by my house. Yeah. <laughs> and you know, that boy, I ain't giving no exact location <laughs> to what he talking about. Anyways, man. So, okay, so Lil Baby. Nah, so, you do what's like one of the DJ academic ad niggas? Like, I, I can see you going famous by, like, breaking down beef and... Gangs, man. I ain't getting into none of that. What are you talking about? I ain't getting into none of that. Shit. that yeah, I ain't nah. got famous snitches. Hey, man, nigga. Hey, nigga, I could never be no snitch. Now I'm talking about academic snitches. Oh, yeah, he did. That's why he's so cool with Takashi yeah. taking a deal. Like, no cap. He feel like, oh, he should have took the deal. He, he, yeah, he exactly. didn't do those things. I would have took the deal, too. But you see, you see, like, yeah. Look, you know, like the type you know, of nigga he posted that um, they song together, you know, meat commented under, yeah. like, he snitched, he done, but I seen people under his comments talking about, uh, goddamn, if I was him, I would have took a deal, too, dude. But, you know, so obviously, the internet think, nigga, the internet nigga. snitching would kill a nigga career? It should. But it won't kill. But it won't kill like his career to the end. He the, the rainbow hair ass yeah. nigga. Like his fans gonna fuck with him. Shit. They just like Casanova said in Reference Club. Like I expected that fifty six. I expected, expected that. that. Like, yeah, like when nobody. When you when you know real shit, you gonna see. The only know people who didn't expect it are the ones that the you know niggas, what I'm saying. Yeah, that really don't know what was going on. The niggas that was following behind them, like nah. But then again, they should have expected that shit. Yeah, like cool to be like y'all. Come on, man. This is the same nigga that's paying y'all to be in the game to pick and y'all was, the crew. And y'all was wiping that nigga nose behind his back. Exactly. So why you, you think you took a whole 3.5 million? Hey, baby mom, y'all you think, think he went on snitch on your stupid ass nigga? Dumb ass nigga. Dumb ass nigga. nigga. I'm gonna keep that shit separate. What bro. your mama told you when you was growing up, nigga? The hell wrong with y'all. You do dirt by yourself. Nigga you can't snitch on yourself. No co defendant, bro. Nah, that shit's stupid nigga. as hell, bro. Lame man, nigga. And y'all know he wasn't built like that. Yeah. Y'all yeah. the one that found this nigga. Exactly. <laughs> y'all and I don't, I, don't nigga. Even, I don't even respect no nigga that, that get paid for a nigga to be in this shit. Like, nigga no. ain't putting no work in. Just exactly. because he give you a million dollars. Was that a lick for fun? y'all? Yeah, y'all, y'all made some money off that. Exactly. Exactly. But is it worth it? Y'all nigga finna, half y'all nigga finna probably do That's why I ain't never game bang, bro. Because that shit. Half no nigga finna do like I fuck with some niggas. I fuck with some nigga that game bang. Yeah, like, it's yeah. a couple cool game banging that, but game banging shit, it just always been kind of lame to me. Like, I don't give a fuck. I read you. Way. That shit lame. Shit ain't my way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm standing on my own. They can't yeah. tell me what color to wear. So, man, so let, let's name some some new rappers or new songs or, you know what I'm saying, shit like that that we fucking with right now. Um, shit, for me, that, you know. I've been fucking with, with the nigga Rallo, Rallo Rodriguez. No cap from um, Mobile. You know. He hard. A nigga, no cap hard. No cap. And no cap said uh, he won't fuck I've been up. fucking with YBS Scholar, but he ain't knew. I've been, I been listening to bro. That's you know, the home. Where he from? Man? B-more. B-more. Okay, you no, know, Baltimore. Me, been shouting him out for yeah, a minute. He been, yeah, he been fucking. Man, before, especially fuck before he went to jail. He was exactly. fucking with that boy hard. I fuck with, um, I fuck with, I've been recently listening, like, I don't think he really got no tape out, but. He got a little collaboration tape. YB and Corday. 
Okay. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He be going in. Yeah, LeBron. I be saying he nah, going crazy. He yeah. Was hard. He was just in and he got a um, Diddy. Exactly. Shit. You know, the little Diddy right. cipher. That shit looks lit in motherfucker Folk too. Definitely about your phone. Um, goddamn, I've been listening to Beast Slime. He from the city. One little key, little partner. He got a couple hard yeah. songs on his tape. Yeah, Beast um, Slime. But you know, that's the nephew. I ain't know that. Yeah, that's the nephew. Oh, so. yeah. They say, you know, he could have been and hopped in the rap shit. Like, yeah. that's he literally playing. the nephew. Like, yeah. bro, mama is the sister. Oh, I ain't know that. Oh, yeah, so he got some like, shit. Yeah, he could have been hopped in and, like, he got some but shit. But he did, he did, you know, young nigga in the street. But uh-huh. me personally, I've been fucking with a couple niggas like Danny Hill. Yeah, Danny Hill going you, crazy, you know man. Bro, man, KK out I now, see. man. No cap. Um, that shit hard. Let me YouTube see. it. No cap. Stream it. My nigga big selfies coming harder than ever, you know what I'm saying? We gonna have to yeah, get, that have to get him on, on the motherfucker one side. But bro, I ain't gonna cap like the nigga hard, bro. Like he been big selfish. Big selfish, man. Y'all for make sure y'all got down at my boy on Instagram. You no know, big selfish underscore, I, I believe. Uh, man, we got some man. I got some folk coming out with some shit, man. My boy Bino the Star Man. Follow him at Bino the Star Man. Never been out of two eighty five. The mix tape on the way. You did. Never been out of two eighty five. Yeah, we should okay. do an episode about that. Man, nigga, ain't never well, been outside some, of two eighty five. I know some niggas like, never real, been outside like, of them like, motherfuckers. Like I'm talking about. And that shit, that you got some shit on there too. <laughs> and my brother, man, Trap Gotti, man, he got his shit coming. Trap Ali, the EP. I think, man, we got some shit coming, man. Who else yeah. you fucking with? Uh, uh, goddamn. I'm saying, low key. Uh, uh. Yeah. I fuck with that nigga name. That nigga name Lil Boo. Lil Boo 36 on Instagram. Y'all get at my boy. You He's know, 36? Lil Boo 36. Oh, I thought he said that nigga 36 nah, years old. Yeah, saying, nah, God damn. Nah, hey, shit. He oh, probably okay. on. He wasn't. He probably. I think yeah, he called me. Call me. Yeah, okay. Yeah. But, um, you know, Lil Boo 36. You know, he just dropped the mixtape to cook up. Going harder than ever. Talking that real shit. Talking that dope boy talk. All that type shit. Real game okay. money. Right there in Lakewood, you know what I'm saying? So, 1600 block. What we got coming up, got down the cook-up pop-up shop. March 9th, you know what I'm saying? We're going to be in there, bitch, to get some Live. vendors. Having folks sell shit, brands. Tell them who to get at if they trying got to, you know what I'm saying? You. Get at me, done, my boy Chez, me for you, Chez, M-E-4-U-C-H-E-Z. You know what I'm saying? Get at nah, it, man. We, we, trying we to got down, shit up. we having some artists come through, perform. We ain't doing no regular... No regular, like, uh, showcase shit. Like, yeah. artist showcase where niggas performing at 3 in the morning type yeah. shit. Like, bro, we got them going from 8 to 12. Niggas going to perform. There's going to be songs played in between. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We're going to party in between. There are a couple performances from 8 to Get 12. Get some good products. You know what I'm saying? saying? Black, black selling black products. Businesses. Yeah, you know, got them con- Connecting with folks, networking, you know man. Networking, you feel me? With your brand, shit, you see, we might shit. get you on the podcast. You coming we in there to make money. Goddamn, we gonna yeah. we gonna get everybody a little. We are gonna try to get everybody a little interview slot, a little two to five minute, real quick. Then we can bring y'all on the show. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. However y'all want to do it, but cook up, pop up shop, March 9th. We got them. We going all the way digital, like from twelve to three. We turning that bitch into a club. We turning up. <laughs> I'm saying I'm being that motherfucker yeah. draped out. Shit, you know, what I'm saying? You know me. Hey, you know me. That man going got that country ass shit. You feel it's me? It's Alabama ass shit, man. Like, hey, no man, man, y'all tuned in to Air Hustle and Fall For It podcast. You know what I'm saying? We got merch on the way, man. We finna get these t shirts right. I promise. They on the way. They on the way, you did. But yeah. shit, y'all for make sure y'all keep t- tuning in. Keep fucking with us. Keep rocking with us. Keep viewing our shit. Just man, keep comment clicking. under our right, shit. Comment, man. man. Don't be scared to talk to us, man. We some real cool ass niggas. No, man, man. Like, okay. I know he ugly in hell, but don't let him scare y'all, ladies. Okay, like, get at us, man. Come on now, my boy Cleveland Junior looking at. He's still going up like a black quad, right? He's still going up. You I don't. That shit was lame as fuck, bro. Anyway, man, we going up with the podcast. We going up. Okay. with your Y'all follow, yeah. follow us. Air Hustle Fall for the podcast, man. Big Bang. Strong as heart, had the most scars. Rodriguez. Yeah. Playing high scotch, playing full squad. Me, Lil Duke, and Lakeem, and Bap. 
fire hide, we ain't had no pool. Close thing to swim. Know the vision, know this, make mama scream like a horror film. They ain't talking money, we got on trucks. The only way we come, bro. Tell the Jack boys ain't shit sweet. Like he ain't never ate a Starburst. Oh man, I'ma paint her face. She want me to paint her car first. Whole line, so I'm lying back. Like Lorenzo Alexander. Party froze a couple on the street. I cheat up with the cheese. In a stolen car, trying to get us from A to B. Police had to kill C. Niggas turn rats some years past. Then get your fade away. But he don't know that shit gon' stay with him. Like he got a roommate. You know we ride when we kill. She do how she live. We sell dough where we stay. We ain't had no gold, we had to shoot in the crate. Playing crap so we can afford a new J's. Lights off again, we can't even see when we bake. Cause DUI, these bills driving, that's crazy. But they don't fit me, cause I'm just a pride, J-Baby.